Hello everyone, I am Didier Bro, the leader for France for Fabriano in Aquarello. I am very proud and honored to have been chosen along with other friends of mine to introduce this very special 2021 session. Indeed, in these complicated times for the planet and particularly difficult for the world of art and artists, it is very important for me to be able to officially open these international watercolor meetings of Fabriano in Aquarello. I will try despite all the suffering, distress, anxieties and disappearances linked to COVID around the world. I will therefore try to have the world, the strength to find reasons for satisfaction in this month of my 2021. The first is to see with what determination, presence, dynamism, all members of Fabriano in Aquarello have worked to be able to offer the world a rich and ambitious program. Anna Massinissa, our charismatic leader, her Italian team always faithful and available, all the leaders of the 80 and some countries who participate in this adventure. I want to say thank you. Thank you very much for all you do for art and for watercolor. Of course, the last two sessions are different from the previous one. Our meetings, our friendly discussions on the terraces of cafes in the older center of Fabriano, the arcades, to find oneself with brushes in hand at the bends of small, cool and shaded alleys, and to be able to paint with a friend from so far away and speak the same language, the watercolors language, has been missed and we still miss. All of this has been and all it will be again, but most certainly differently. We artists are very often, and especially in Western countries, little listened to or even ignored. We are part of the system too. We are the system. And as such, we must also adapt, evolve, think about our future actions, our habits, the functioning of our system, our little watercolor world. This pandemic reveals to us how open our world has become, without limits, without any human scale measures, and at the mercy of the tiniest enemy there is. After this pandemic, the world will not be quite the same. At least, maybe I really hope so. Should we worry about it, regret it? I don't know. What I know, what I feel deeply, is that whatever we think, we have to evolve. We have to adapt for our children, for the future of humanity, for our planet. How? I think it's quite simple and complicated at the same time. We have to slow down, take the time to live, to limit encounters but live them more intensely. We have entered an era of material overconsumption, but our meetings, our relationships, our friends are now more and more on this same mode of consumption of consumerism. More and more relationships, but more and more virtual, superficial, and therefore less and less real, deep and of quality. Fewer trips, fewer encounters intended to be seen, to appear, but more encounters to be. Less travel, less planes, less pollution, less parades and selfishness to satisfy our ego, but more sharing, support development around us, close to us to help other painters to feel free, creative and belong to this novel family 
play of artists with a capital A. <coughs> Let's try to reason with our practices very recent of virtualization of computer shares, virtual exhibitions, competitions, in order to be able to say, I have been selected. Not necessarily proof of the quality of our work, but of the quality of our network or of what we potentially represent. Be careful. I am not saying not to do anything, else otherwise for what also continue Fabriano. I'm just saying to reason with ourselves, to slow down and think more locally. Even the virtual has a huge carbon footprint. I don't want to end up on these words that may sound sad or defeatist. No, on the contrary, I have faith in all of us to adapt, to evolve, to find other modes of operation that are more respectful, more collective, and less egocentric, less on appearing and more on being. So it's up to you, to me, to us, to change, to evolve, to find solutions to build a world that is going to be, that must be different. Let's not try to start over on the same basis. Let's slow down. Watercolor can help us. Watercolor should help us. Thank you for your attention. And I wish you a very good Fabriano in Aquarello. Enjoy with all of the interviews, a lot of demonstrations, lecture panels, etc. So, bye bye.